Hello my darlings, welcome back and thank you so much for joining me for a very very special video. Today is my 2021 small business gift guide. I did this video for the first time last year and I absolutely loved it. I think it was my favourite video of the entire year and I wanted to do the same again this year. And this is not just any small business gift guide, this is buying my Christmas gifts from you guys, from my subscribers and from your companies. Throughout the entire year, you guys support me and my business just by watching my videos and I wanted to show my support and show my gratitude by bringing the spotlight to your businesses this year. So once again, I put a blast out here on YouTube and also over on my Instagram and asked you to send in your businesses and I have got the most incredibly talented bunch of subscribers. The products and brands that I'm gonna be sharing with you today are not only so beautiful, so high, such high quality, the websites that I have been browsing have been so gorgeously designed. The shipping, the process has been an absolute dream, giving these big brands a run for their money. We've had another crazy year, haven't we? So I think it's really nice to support smaller brands again this Christmas. And it's really lovely to gift someone something a little bit different something that you're not going to find on every single high street. These gifts are often just a little bit more thoughtful, that little bit more unique and you can make such a big impact to smaller brands by shopping small this Christmas. So I've had great fun scrolling through the hundreds and thousands of businesses you guys have sent in. I've chosen and purchased from a few of my favorites. Sadly, of course, I couldn't feature them all. But if you do have your own small business, then I would love you to leave a link to your website in the comments section down below so that as a Fashion Mumbler community, we can support each other, shop from each other's businesses. So don't be afraid to leave your links down below. I'll also be checking through the comments and making more Christmas gift purchases from your businesses. I would definitely also encourage you to go back and watch last year's video. It was the first time I had done a buying gifts from my subscribers businesses small business gift guide. I love that video and I'd love to show my support and I'd love for you guys to shop from the businesses that I featured last year as well. But now for 2021 I have a whole host of new businesses to share with you. This video can get quite long so I'm just gonna get stuck in with the first business and darlings of course all the businesses that I'm sharing in today's video will be linked in the description box down below. So go ahead, have a browse of the websites, show your support. We have such an amazing community here on YouTube, so how lovely to be able to buy our Christmas gifts for our friends and family and loved ones from other members of the Fashion Mumbler community. So without further ado, let's get started. In no particular order, I just have an entire room filled with the most amazing products. I'm gonna get started with a brand called Serena Days. Now this is the most gorgeous loungewear and pajama brand and I feel like pajamas are such a classic gift to give this Christmas. I actually already have a set of these PJs in the beautiful cream color with my initials in gold but then I saw on the website that they have just bought out this beautiful color called chai latte and I thought it was absolutely perfect. So so flattering. I've gone ahead and ordered another pair of the long pajama bottoms because I have the white trousers in the long and they are so comfy, so cozy. I would literally say the softest pajamas that I have ever experienced, so could not recommend those any more highly. And who doesn't love to receive a new pair of pajamas at Christmas time? I know I should have ironed these pieces <laughs> before showing you, that is a rookie error, but they also have a really, really classic t-shirts. And who says you have to wear these just as pajama t-shirts? They are so soft. These are softer than my Reese t-shirt, softer than my Whistles t-shirt. Literally the quality of these, I'm so, so impressed with. And also this cute little pair of shorts with this little ruffle detail. I do get very warm in bed, so sometimes I like to wear little shorts instead of long length pajamas. But these are going straight in my pajama drawer because they are without a doubt the coziest pajamas in the entire world. As well as pajamas, I feel that jewelry is such a perfect Christmas gift and I have so many favorite jewelry brands. As I'm sure you know, I'm always sharing my jewelry favorites here on my channel. But did you know I actually used to have my own jewelry brand? It was my first business. It was called Fiction Candy Jewelry and I used to make clay charms that looked like dolly mixtures or love hearts or licorice all sorts. I even had a fast food bracelet. I would spend hours and hours and hours making these charms and I would sell them at local crafts fairs, um, local school fates and Christmas fairs and things like that. And let me tell you, you know that meme going around on TikTok where it's like every time you buy from a small business, someone somewhere does a little happy dance. 
I know from past experience that that is so true. Every single sale would really mean the world to me, which is why I do have a few of my subscribers' jewelry brands to share with you today. So the first one, I just thought these were so fun and so gorgeous, and I know exactly who I'm gonna gift these to this Christmas, although it will break my heart to part ways with them. These absolutely fantastic little lobster earrings you can buy these little shell jewellery cases separately and the company is called Jewellery de la Mer. So you will find all kinds of aquatic designs from seahorses, starfish to these gorgeous little lobsters and I think they are so beautifully crafted, so unusual. You'd never see any of the mainstream jewellery brands doing anything like this and just such gorgeous presentation. So Jewellery de la Mer, if you know someone that has got a crush on crustaceans or a love of lobster then Jewellery de la Mer is a fantastic website to check out. The next brand that I want to share with you is one that I'm going to have to insert an overlay of the product because mine is outdoors and quite possibly covered in soil at the moment and yes it is my Claverton Cloche. So Claverton Cloche is a company that is based here in the Cotswolds, the very south of the Cotswolds down in Bath in fact and they hand make these beautiful cloches which is just the ultimate gift if you know someone who likes to grow things from seed, loves to cherish their little tiny kales, their little baby spinach is in the garden. They are so, so beautiful. And it's a small family run business. They've actually had some amazing press this year. I've seen them in, I think, Country Life magazine and The Times. I've seen them featured absolutely loads. So no doubt they are smashing it. But I personally love my cloches. I treated myself to the set of three earlier this year and I absolutely adore them. So I think they would be a fantastic gift this Christmas. Up next is a brand that I did actually feature in last year's video, but I think it is such a wonderful idea and such a great brand that everyone needs to know about them. And it is a brand called Caddo Paperworks. I didn't realize until last year that most Christmas wrapping paper is not recyclable. If they've got glitter on them, certain types of glitter, or if they have got that shiny kind of plastic backing, they're not biodegradable, they are not recyclable. And if you put them in the bin bag with other paper bits, it contaminates the rest of the bits in your recycling, which is not ideal. Caddo Paperworks have got completely recyclable Christmas wrapping and they have just got the most elegant and beautiful designs. Here are a few of my favorites. So first of all, can you see that gorgeous design? This mistletoe wrapping paper. I'm also so happy for Caddo Paperworks because their products are now available to buy in Dalesford. I purchased some of their mistletoe wrapping tape along with a couple of other things when we were last there. And this is the matching wrapping paper. They also do the most beautiful Christmas cards. Again, fully recyclable and they use vegetable ink for all their printing. Compostable and recyclable natural dyed hessian ribbon. I think there is nothing more chic than a gift wrapped in recycled or recyclable paper and then with a beautiful, with a beautiful ribbon, perhaps something from the outdoors, whether it's a sprig of thyme or a sprig of holly, I think that is the most elegant way of wrapping your gifts and the most sustainable way as well. Gosh, they just have so much twine. This is the recyclable wrapping tape with this gorgeous mistletoe designs. Christmas tree wrapping paper, Christmas tree tape. Honestly, they have got the most gorgeous designs on their website. So definitely check out pa Caddo Paperworks if you want to wrap your presents and support a small business and ensure that your presents are wrapped in a more sustainable and environmentally friendly way as well. A brand that you may have already heard me talking about here on my channel because I have been wearing these pieces since summer is Clementine and Mint. Clementine and Mint is the most beautiful hair accessory brand and I'm now the proud owner of three of their padded headbands. I'm a huge headband lover. I think it's a trend. I think it's a style that never goes out of fashion. So I've got the gorgeous large pink padded headband, this beautiful kind of olive green, which is so good for the festive season and the classic white. So if you know a hair Hair accessory lover then these are just the most beautiful quality if you look up close you can see they're kind of like a textured linen which I think is so so beautiful I have to say I love how many of my followers have pets related businesses and one that I just thought was such a beautiful website and gorgeous product is one called Mutterly Fabulous. So Mutterly Fabulous was actually launched last year during COVID and they have the most beautiful harnesses and dog leads and other accessories. I chose these two, they are slightly different colors. Um, one is slightly more silvery and one is more olivey and the detail and the craftsmanship on these is so incredible. It's almost like a silky rope 
um, with these brass finishes. I think this is just such a beautiful gift if you do know anyone who has got a new little puppy in their life over the last year or maybe just has a really boring dog lead and needs an upgrade, then must be fabulous. So I've got the most beautiful dog accessories. Dexie and Dickie are gonna be very excited to receive these in their stockings this year. Some of these businesses are literally brand new and one business that I have been blown away by the most beautiful packaging is Pastel Notes. Pastel Notes by Lena a follower of mine from Germany, and Lena has written the sweetest note. Dear Josie, it's unbelievable that you really read my message and bought a notebook yourself. You've made my day, I can't stop smiling, I'm so grateful. Two more of my personal favorites are added to your order. Lena, that is very generous, thank you. I absolutely love pastel shades and playful floral patterns. With Pastel Notes, which is a small shop for everyone who's into pastel colors and everything around pastel colored stationery, my dream of creativity and self-fulfillment came true. Everything is still at the very beginning, but who doesn't remember his or her first small steps as a self-managed business? Lena, that is so true. You never know where it's gonna go. Oh my gosh, they are just so beautiful. So these are the notebooks from Pastel Notes. Such gorgeous designs. Inside, you can either go for plain or some of these have got square markers, depending on how you're going to use them, whether it's for school, writing your shopping list, keeping tabs on your to-do list. That is definitely how I'll be using mine. This one is so beautiful. Good vibes only, my little notebook. And this one has got some beautiful anemones. Or are they white poppies? I can never tell the difference. Looking at the seed pods, maybe these are poppies. Just such gorgeous designs. Really lovely lightweight notebooks. So perfect for keeping in your handbag as well. Another classic Christmas gift is socks, but socks can be either very boring or very luxurious, and I definitely recommend gifting the luxurious kind. Another of my followers has an incredible business called Hilly Joe, and these are, these actually came in the most beautiful gift box, a pair, two pairs of alpaca socks made here in the UK. Alpaca, like cashmere, I think I probably have some alpaca in this jumper actually, keeps you so, so, so warm. Often when I'm out on dog walks and I'm with friends and they say their feet are getting cold and I'm wearing alpaca or cashmere socks, my feet are toasty. I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. My feet are so toasty warm. So never underestimate the warmth of good quality socks. And I thought the shades of these are just so, so classic. They've got lots of different box sets on their website. So instead of buying your luxury cashmere socks from one of the big companies this Christmas, have a little look at Hilly Joe website. I'm sure you'll be able to find a beautiful pair that your recipient will love that they have come from a smaller brand. So a little confession, I have got a thing for tea towels. I love a good tea towel with a beautiful pattern on it. And so I was really excited to see a beautiful collection of tea towels on one of my followers' websites called Toasted Crumpet. I love that business name. Who doesn't love a toasted crumpet on a winter morning? And they have got the most amazing selection of home textiles, but I decided to pick up a few tea towels. I think the tea towels make a really nice gift, especially if you're gifting a host or hostess this Christmas. If you get invited over to someone's house for Christmas, drinks, you're not sure what to take, maybe they've already got enough booze, you don't want to give them the chore of cutting up and displaying flowers, then tea towels are such a lovely gift idea. So the four that I chose, let me show you in close-up detail, I love robins and I think a dark tea towel is very very practical and this one's quite festive with the pine cones and the little berries. This one I thought was great for anyone um, that we visit has a slightly more chic kitchen. You've got eucalyptus, you've got mistletoe in a more kind of neutral colorway. This one is just absolutely gorgeous and I'm definitely gonna be keeping this one for myself. I'll probably order a few more of this design with this beautiful bluey purple hydrangea. And then my love for Robins continues. I just thought this one was so sweet. A very festive and just lovely design. And it says these are proudly designed and made in Britain. While a lot of my friends have been getting puppy dogs over lockdown, a lot of my friends as well have been having babies. So when I saw that one of my followers has a gorgeous website of gifts for little ones called Little You, I decided to pick up a few pieces which I will be gifting to friends with new little ones this Christmas. So Little You has got a really gorgeous selection. A lot of the products are sustainably crafted. They're very chic in their design and yet I think they'll be 
the kind of gifts that not only are cute to give but also really useful the first thing is this soft activity toy obviously i think this is best suited to a newborn you've got these little bunny characters and these squidgy little rings which apparently are great for teething friends of mine that have got babies say that you can never have too many muslin cloths and i thought these ones were quite chic organic cotton muslin cloths in this creamy color and then this kind of natural almost olive color as well beautifully presented wrapped in ribbon a great little stocking filler for a new mum and then if this is what i think i remember ordering yes so it's actually a really good idea so this is <laughs> it looks really funny it's called a door silencer or a door stop it's basically a gummy like a squidgy lemon and you wedge this on your door and it stops the door from shutting loudly which is such a good idea i don't really know much about having children but i'm guessing you want to have the door slightly ajar especially if there's a fairly young baby in the room and this is going to be a great way of keeping the door ajar or stopping if a door for example just suddenly slams shut and it's quite loud could wake the baby then this is a great little way of stopping that happen and then i thought this was quite a good idea if you've got any friends that do have little ones but they also do a lot of travel Traveling. This is a play and go travel mat. So basically, I'm not going to undo it because I'll probably never be able to get it back in. It's like a little mini um, play fabric circle thing and then you keep all of their toys in this and then like those makeup bags you just pull the string and all the toys get stored inside. So a nice easy way of storing and traveling little ones favorite toys when you are on the go. Up next, another beautiful jewellery brand that I wanted to share with you, and Murray is a jewellery brand created by a fellow content creator, Kate from Dolly Bobo. I've followed Kate for so many years, and she has got a gorgeous jewellery brand with the most beautiful pieces. I'm also a little bit obsessed with her packaging. They come in these beautiful blush pink suede or kind of like velvet containers. Dun, dun, dun. How gorgeous is that? This would be such a beautiful gift. So I chose this ring, first of all, um, which is really Really gorgeous you will be able to see hopefully in a bit more detail this beautiful textured ring it almost looks like it has shards of crystal within it so so gorgeous especially if you know someone who loves to stack their jewelry I think that could be a really beautiful stacking piece such a beautiful such a unique design and then I thought these were rather fabulous as well kind of along similar lines in that they've got a very organic and natural shape this is a pair of hoop earrings always quite hard to show you such intricate pieces but I thought they were absolutely stunning and the quality of these is just absolutely gorgeous they almost look like little antiques and yeah I'm just obsessed these cases as much as i absolutely love to receive flowers especially as a gift when we are hosting it does break my heart how they don't last that long which is why i think preserved and faux flowers are a really really gorgeous gift especially when they are of good quality so this is a beautiful brand from one of my followers called Tabitha Lily and I saw that they had this beautiful autumnal arrangement on their website. I think these are the most realistic faux flowers I've ever seen. In fact, I'm not sure if they're actually um, preserved or if they are artificial. That is how incredible the quality is. So I've got this really lovely autumnal cluster. I'm going to create a really beautiful arrangement in a vase and it'll look perfect in our entrance hall. I don't need to worry about watering it. It's a nice way of adding that outside touch into your house, but less high maintenance than a traditional fresh bunch of flowers. One of my followers has the most beautiful business called From The Hill Crafts and you can buy DIY wreath kits from their website. I think that's such a lovely idea, such a such an interactive gift a great again something really lovely to give a host obviously not for her to make there and then but spend some time enjoying a little bit of craft and downtime afterwards so you do get the full instructions on how to make your wreath and then beautifully packaged in here we have got orange slices fur cones small fur cones a moss wreath base twine on a stick a pheasant feather and four bunches of berries so i'll try not to drop this all over the place but this is what you get inside your wreath making kit the twine the pines the berries and the orange slices all you have to do is head out into your garden and grab some foliage you can really pick anything whether it's yew sprigs or general hedgerow pieces your wreath is going to be totally unique to you depending on, on depending on what foliage you pick but i think that's a really lovely craft project something fun to do with your friends 
I did mention some luxury face masks in last year's Christmas videos and I'm not gonna lie, I did not think I'd be mentioning them again this year, but here we are a year later, still in need of face masks. So if you're still wearing disposable ones or you know someone, or you know someone that does wear one every day for work, perhaps needs a little luxury upgrade, then one of my lovely followers companies, Peony and Mulberry is one to check out. They have got the most beautiful quality silk face masks. I actually always have one of their face masks in my handbag. I love the blush pink shade. They've also got black, which is great for chaps and chic ladies as well. And they come with filters, which is great, especially if you are going to be in real close proximity. Peony and Mulberry also have, they have a whole selection of silk things from silk pillowcases, silk hair bubbles, silk face masks, and I also have this lovely selection of silk hair bubbles, which is so much better for your hair. No snagging, no pulling, and they look a whole lot more luxurious when your hair is tied up in a bun, finished off with a lovely silk scrunchie. How festive does that look? By Boxing Day, I've probably not washed my hair for about four days, so a low bun is definitely in order. So a low festive bun finished off with a gold silk scrunchie, absolutely beautiful. Um, they've also just launched sheepskin rugs this year, which is a really lovely gift for the homeowner, a really nice snuggly addition to a bedroom. And they also have cashmere socks. This is just a classic cream pair of cashmere socks, perfect for wearing as bed socks, wearing around the house, or just keeping your feet extra cozy while you are out and about exploring this festive season. Now every time this features in one of my videos I always get a lot of questions. It is my diary and this is from a small business called Inspired Stories which is actually co-owned by my friend and fabulous photographer Kat. They have the most amazing selection of stationery whether it's notebooks, diaries, they've got folios and ring binders now and everything is personalizable. This is my diary that I'm using currently. It's got JF written down here and what I love about um, Inspired Stories not only is the outside beautiful but also the inside. You often get little prompts for mindful moments as well. This one is asking you to jot down when do you feel most motivated and energetic. The layout of these diaries I find so so useful. You've got weekly reflection areas, important to do lists, habit and exercise tracking. <laughs> My important to do on May the 3rd was plant spinach. There's even a section at the beginning of each month with your monthly goals, how you're going to reach it, your monthly wish list, books to read, places to visit, so it's a really, really lovely diary, very practical, but also very thought invoking and creative for the mindful and creative recipient this Christmas. I would definitely recommend checking out the Inspired Stories website. They have so many beautiful gifts and they have so very kindly extended a discount code to my followers. So click the link in the description box down below and you'll get 10% off your order. Up next is another pet brand and this is one that Charlie and I have been adorning Dexter and Dickens with for many years, and it is Teddy Maximus. The boys absolutely love their Teddy Maximus harnesses, and they continue to bring out the most beautiful designs every year. So this is Dexter and Dickens Autumn Winter 2022 look, and it is a really beautiful classic tweed harness with brown detailing, very countryside appropriate. They are the perfect little harnesses for sausage dogs, perfect for their little long bodies, and you've got this little gold hoop at the top here for clipping your lead on to, as well as these harnesses which we have got personalized with the boys names so so sweet this is honestly such a lovely gift idea for anyone that has just got a little doggy or someone that has had a doggy for a little while but just needs to update their wardrobe <laughs> They also have things like harnesses, dog beds, you name it. It's a really, really lovely website. So I would definitely recommend checking out Teddy Maximus. So I've obviously just mentioned some faux flowers, but there is something so lovely about having fresh blooms in your house every week. So I think that having a flower subscription is such a wonderful idea. And we have a Freddy's Flowers subscription and it is still a very small business. So it's really lovely to support a growing flower business. They do everything they can to make their deliveries more sustainable. There's no plastic involved and the blooms are always so, so beautiful. So a gift of a Freddy's Flowers subscription I think is a really lovely idea. You get either a fortnightly, monthly, weekly delivery, not quite letterbox flowers, but these, but it's such a treat to open the door and find these by my doorstep. I get them every other Tuesday. You get a little bit of information as to the bouquet that you're getting, flower care information, how to style your blooms, and then the flowers come beautifully presented, wrapped up in craft paper, and you bet I save it <laughs> and reuse the paper. And I find it a very therapeutic task 
every other week putting together my blooms. This week's one is a little bit more festive. We've got some thistle in there, we've got some lilies, some eucalyptus, and some of this foliage I find lasts a little bit longer than the blooms. So I'll save my eucalyptus and my teasel and thistle foliage and use that in my Christmas wreath making this year as well. I do believe I still have a valid discount code for Freddy's Flowers as well, which is Josie50, which will get you 50% off your first two boxes or the first two boxes within the subscription if you are gifting a subscription to someone else, which I think is such a good idea for mums, mother-in-laws, sisters, aunties. And flowers aren't just for ladies, for uncles, brothers, fathers, why not? I always think that personalized gifts are the loveliest gifts to give and receive and Burke's homewares make the most beautiful personalized charms. I have the most gorgeous selection here. We could use these as key charms or Christmas tree decorations. One here that says the Irons Clan. We have got one, a star, ho ho ho, Dickens, Dexter, Charlie and Josie. These would be really useful for labeling our Christmas stockings. Josie's shed. <laughs> I'm gonna hang this on the door of the shed and um, see how long it takes Charlie to get annoyed that it's officially labelled Josie's Shed. Jolly, joy, just really sweet little handmade decorations for adding that personal touch to your Christmas tree. I also think that giving the gift of a relaxing spa treatment is such a lovely idea and I know that a lot of my followers are local, many of you are in and around the Cotswolds, so I could not recommend any more highly my friend Sally's business, which is Solstice Wellbeing. You can buy gift vouchers, you can also buy little sets of oils, but giving the gift of a treatment by Sally is such a wonderful gift idea. Even if you don't live locally, perhaps you have got a stay coming up at Straw Top Cottage. We are releasing more availability very, very soon, by the way, so keep an eye on the website. Um, but if you are coming to the Cotswolds anytime soon, then giving the gift of a treatment from Sally at Solstice Wellbeing is such a gorgeous gift. She uses really beautiful essential oils. It's more of a holistic kind of treatment, but she has got the best massage technique I think I've ever experienced. So that would be a really, really lovely gift for someone this Christmas to have a festive treat in her shepherd's hut or perhaps save the treatment for January, February when those cold dark long days leave your muscles aching and you just need someone to give you the ultimate pampering. And then I have another homeware business. Charlie and I love to have beautiful homewares in the house and in the kitchen especially and I just absolutely adore the products that they have got at Oatmeal and Sage. I chose these beautiful bowls. I think they go really nicely with the style of our kitchen. They'll match in really nicely with our other bits of crockery. Perfect for soup soups and pastas. I'm going to make myself a butternut squash soup in one of these right now. And then they have very kindly also included these little pinch bowls. These are great for so many things, whether it's little selections of nut seasoning and spices on a Christmas table, olives, olive pips, things like that. And it's just the most beautiful kind of stone coloured earthenware, exactly the kind of style that we love here at the house. So I picked up six of these really beautiful rustic bowls from Oatmeal and Sage, and I think they're just going to look absolutely gorgeous in our kitchen. I can't believe it's taken me this long into the video to talk about candles, another thing which I think is such a great gift idea. And this year, I'm going to be sharing a few of my favourites from one of my followers' brands, Rebecca Tracy. I think my favourite of hers is the Winter Spice Candle. Our luxurious... Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is the best festive scent I have literally ever smelt. Hands down the best. Our luxurious candles are lovingly hand-created using only the finest, non-genetically modified soil wax and 100% pure essential oils. Homemade in the UK by Rebecca Tracy, Stratford-upon-Avon. So, so local. This is what the candle looks like in this beautiful, chic, frosted brown br brass, brown glass container, beautiful soy wax candle. This is a real, like, spicy, cinnamony, nutmeggy, orangey, zesty, literally Christmas in a candle that is so, so gorgeous. And then one which is a little bit more kind of fresh, and this one is supporting our heroic NHS, love that. Enjoy the therapeutic benefits of your pure candle with vitamin E hydrating the skin. Oh my gosh, so you can melt this candle and use it as a moisturizer or for massage. Rub it into your temples, vitamin E hydrating the skin. Love that. So this is her Florence candle, which can be used on the body as well. And this is a more kind of zesty, fresh smelling candle, depend depending on your fragrance preference. Another homeware brand whose website I really enjoyed looking through, they had loads of really lovely sustainable options on the website, is 
Emile O'Connor and her home store. Now, I actually, I absolutely love this gift that I have chosen. I'm not quite sure who I'm gonna give this to. Kind of wanna keep it myself. It is this bowl. You could use this as a salad bowl or if you've got some leftover bits after your roast dinner, pop them in here. I think it's bamboo um, and it has got these little sketches of manatees around the edge. I just think it is so, so sweet. This is, it's really lightweight as well. So this would be great for picnicking, probably a little bit big for a lunchbox, but I'm pretty sure they had lots of different sizes. So a really lovely bowl. And then this could be used as a little chopping board or serving board. And you've got these servers built in the lid as well. Such a beautiful design. I love the entire website. They had so many fun designs um, of this kind of thing and other very chic and sustainable kitchen pieces on their website. So perhaps you know someone that has moved into a new home or someone that is great with their cooking and needs a little bit of an upgrade of their kitchenware, then Emily... <laughs> Did I say Emile? Emily O'Connor Home Store. Definitely check that website out. They had so, so many gorgeous bits on there. And last but not least, another brand that I did feature last year, but I love their products so much that I made another purchase this year, and it is Sioda So. They have gorgeous silk pajamas. I've been wearing mine a lot lately. You might have seen them in my recent vlogs. And also the most beautiful faux blooms. I'm gonna be updating the flowers in my dressing room with these. I love the mix of hydrangeas, anemones, I don't actually know what these little white ones are, but they're absolutely gorgeous. Really beautiful quality and the edit of flowers that they put together is so, so chic. I think it'd be really nice to almost put these in a vase or in a pot and present them as a completed bunch. But equally, they do come beautifully wrapped in the tissue paper with a ribbon. And they have so many different designs on Sio de Sew. So check out their website for flowers and gorgeous silk pajamas as well. I could be here all day, darlings. There are so, so many amazing businesses that I really want to share with you. This is just a snapshot. I will be sharing so many more over on my Instagram and on my newsletter and on my blog, so stay tuned. But that is all that we have time for today. Thank you so much everyone that did send in their small businesses everything will be linked in the description box down below i would love to encourage you to pick up your christmas gifts from a small business this year so darlings thank you so much for watching i'll see you very soon in the next one